The Semtex administration and reporting system allows instructors and administrators to set up and modify groups according to your reporting needs. This video covers how to create and edit reporting groups and add and remove faculty members and students in the groups. Select the group icon at the top of the page. You will see all active groups that you have access to. If you have past groups that are now inactive, or you want to see all of your groups regardless of their status, select the relevant option. Find the group you want to modify and click on the first page you can add or change faculty members who have access to this group. Note that you will not see your own name, only other instructors. Once you are done making your selections, click Save at the bottom of the page. To add or remove students from this group, scroll back up and click Add Students. Now you'll see all the students that are in your school's domain. A check mark indicates that that student is assigned to this group. Unselect a checkbox if you wish to remove them. Click Save to save your changes. On the Edit Group page, you can also change the name of the group if you ever need to. If you ever want to create a new group, you can do this from the Groups page. Click on Add Group. Type in a group name that you want to use, then add faculty and students as described a moment ago for editing a group. Remember to save the new group. Something to bear in mind is that students need to be assigned to a group before they can be viewed in reports. If your students are purchasing their own access, you will need to manually add them to your group. If you're using an LMS, students can be automatically added to the group if you have a recent implementation. But not all LMS systems and versions support that feature. If not, you will need to add your students to the reporting group yourself. For more information about that, check with the Semtex customer support team. If you don't see a student listed at all in the Add Groups or Edit Groups page, that usually means that they have not created their account yet. They would need to do this by purchasing their own subscription through a custom purchase link that you had requested. Or, if you're using an LMS, their account will be created for the first time they click on a Semtex assignment. However, if you have a student that has already purchased their subscription and has been emailed their receipt and you still don't see them listed, please contact us through the website chat window and we will make sure that their account is linked to your school. That completes our overview of the administration side of the group.semtix.com. If you have any questions, you can chat with one of our customer support team on the website. We're available during U.S. business hours and early evening. If no one is available, simply leave your email address and one of our team will get back with you.